Ons Jabour reached two Grand Slam finals in 2022. Tunisian star Ons Jabour thought she would would be quitting tennis to become a housewife before an outstanding 2022 that saw her reach two Grand Slam finals. Jabour, 28, had never previously been beyond the quarter-finals of a major tournament, but captured the hearts of fans at Wimbledon on her run at SW19. After becoming the first African and Arab woman to reach the final of a slam, she was beaten in three sets by Kazakhstani player Elena Ryabakina. Later in the year, she repeated the feat at the U.S. Open, but was unable to match world no one Iga Swiatek. Jabour, however, finished the year as the number two, and a gauge of her impact is that she is one of the players set to star in the upcoming Netflix tennis series, Breakpoint. The docuseries premieres on Friday, January 13, and in episode 4 Jabour makes a candid admission, I thought that I would be quitting tennis. That I will be a housewife. But I always believed in my dream, she said. The star also receives high praise from Chrissy Everett, who recognized her breakthrough achievement by saying, Ons coming from and representing the Arab nations and the African nations is doing something that nobody else has ever done. Former Wimbledon champion Maria Sharapova is also lavish with her praise, adding, to come from nowhere, without any resources. Any investments in getting past all the barriers and the significance of what that means for her country, for herself, for her family, it's incredible. Jabour's season was arguably kick-started in Spain in May, when seated eighth at the Madrid Open she overcame the likes of Belinda Bensic and Simona Halep to reach her first WTA 1000 Tour final. There, she beat American Jessica Pagula before winning the German Open a month later. Jabour's post-match reaction spoke volumes, I can't believe it. It's crazy, I'm just so happy, she exclaimed. I want to scream so loud. Getting this title is all I've worked for, this is a big, big step that will make me believe more in myself and makes me believe I can win a Grand Slam. As per her ranking, Jabour will be seated second for the Australian Open this month, behind Swiatek. The Tunisian reached the last eight at Albert Park, two years ago.